wanted to record myself washing my hair yesterday was the beginning of my wash day. My wash days, honey, are two days. Well, not two days, but a whole day. Is really, really thick and long. So, um, yesterday I detangled my hair and yeah, I just detangled it a little bit. Um, my hair was so knotted. I had so many knots at the end. My end still needs to be clipped, but as you can see, that's a little knot there. You just pull it off, literally. My hair is not coming out. It's just knots because I did the dumbest thing that I'll never do again. I had a hairstyle in my head already. I had braids. And I took my hair out and I didn't detangle it, wash it or anything like that. I just took the braids out and threw it in a puff. And I, I wore a puff for a while. So the type of hair I have, I have too much hair to do things like that. My hair does feel really, really soft. So what I'm doing now is I'm just washing out the deep conditioner. So I'm washing out this side and I'm gonna finish this side and I'm gonna twist it up and then I'm gonna go to this side because I got too much hair. This is all my hair just on one side of my head. So I have way too much hair to have both sides out. Hair is clean. My scalp is a little irritated because I was really... different from a lot of people because my hair is super super thick as you can see I also have low porosity hair which means my hair absorbs moisture really easy but it lets go the moisture really easy too first I use my handy dandy spray bottle re-wet my hair because my hair like I said it loses the moisture really quick so it dries really fast um so water this has this has um leave-in conditioner inside of it i'm gonna re-wet my hair with that and then after that i take my hydrating um hair tea mix and i use it to spray my hair as well Make sure I get that. And then I just go in to do another um, quick detangle. Because my hair tangles really, really quick because of the fact that I have so much of it on my head. And I move in with my hair butter grease. This is my own brand of hair butter grease, as you can see. I done put a dent in it. Um, it's a Moringa hair butter grease. I love this grease. It's really moisturizing. Um, has castor oil in it, has shea butter. It has uh, cocoa butter. It has different herbs and oils and all that in there to just put that moisture back in there i like a lot of it well not a lot but it might be a lot to y'all but it's not a lot to me and um my hair make sure i'm getting it on my scalp the next thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use my strengthening and growth oil to as a seal so i use this to seal in the moisture and to seal in the hydration um so yeah i just
ahead and I'm gonna come back halfway through to show y'all what's going on. Okay, so, hey y'all. So this is a whole new day. Um, I said I was gonna come back halfway through to show y'all where, how I was coming along, but I didn't. Um, so yeah, this is how I finished my hair. Um, I did all of the twists, as you can see. My hair looks really moisturized and healthy. So I just finished twisting it. Um, it's not perfect. I don't really care for perfect, like hard and perfect and all that. I kind of like that natural look or whatever. So um, I just put some little beads on the tips of my hair and you know, little beads. I put a little clip there and yeah, that is um, my hair. 